Star Wars Episode 9 is set to end the Skywalker saga and the sequel trilogy itself by writer and director J.J. Abrams and Chris Terrio. This is Mike Zero. If you guys are new to the channel, do make sure to subscribe to see future Star Wars content. Now, one thing that a lot of people are really looking forward to is, of course, the first set of footage of this movie in the form of a teaser trailer that'll let all fans around the world know the tone of the movie and exactly J.J. Abrams' vision of the final installment of this current trilogy. Now, these past couple of weeks or so, we've been learning a whole lot more about this film when it comes to some of the set leaks, the set designs, the concept art and storyboard descriptions, etc. However, what's really intriguing has all to do with the teaser itself, and this is where things begin to get very exciting. Now, additionally, what's really dis what's really interesting for sure is that it's described that Mark Hamill shot footage specifically for one of the trailers for Episode 9, and that JJ, Disney, and Lucasfilm, as well as the marketing department, are trying very hard to sell the character of Luke in Episode 9, to let casual fans know that Mark Hamill is back as Luke Skywalker once more. Additionally, it's said that John Williams has finished doing some of the tracks for the musical pieces for the teasers, and that they have heavy elements of the prequels embedded in them. It's currently unclear if the Luke footage shot is going to be used for the teaser in the near future or a trailer for the fall later this year of 2019. It's described that the teaser will be longer than the one revealed at Star Wars Celebration for The Force Awakens and is considered to be very fast paced with a lot of quick glimpses of shots that will capture the audience. It's also said that the end of the teaser has a money shot that will take fans by surprise that fans won't be able to predict and will leave many dying for answers for the next couple of months. So I really want to go over a couple of parts about this when it comes to the teaser. Now, first things first, what is a step in the right direction here is, of course, Mark Hamill, how he shot footage for one of the teasers of Episode 9, because Disney, Lucasfilm, JJ, and the marketing department are trying to sell the character of Luke in this movie, most likely in the form of a flashback. I highly, highly doubt that they're going to show us the Force Ghost version of Luke on screen. So the Luke that we will see most likely is of course going to be in the form of a flashback very similar to what JJ Abrams did with of course the first actual teaser that was shown at celebration where we got to see Luke and R2D2 next to the fire and the burning temple so it's probably going to be something like that now the big mystery is is this going to be for the teaser in the near future or is this going to be for the teaser and or trailer for of course the fall of this year which is a very you know Pretty much it's very far away at this point. So with that being said, it's really good to know that they are trying to push the character of Luke Skywalker into the teaser trailer of Star Wars Episode 9 in order to really sell the character and to really tell the fans that he is back in action in this movie in some way, shape, or form, one way or another, right? Now the next thing that really does intrigue me is how the musical pieces by John Williams are all done and completed for the teaser. Now, in case you guys did not know, they had a lot of marketing shakeups. They were changing different parts of the teasers and the trailers for episode nine here and there. Some things had to actually be pretty much redone and basically completely redeveloped. So now that episode nine and the marketing of this movie is pretty much complete at this point and that filming is finally over for episode nine, they just have some reshoots in April of this year year so we got that to look forward to right uh, everything really is starting to fall into place here and the thing that really does capture you know my whole entire interest for episode 9 for the teaser itself is that it's described that the teaser will be longer than the one revealed at Star Wars Celebration for The Force Awakens way back I believe it was either in 2015 I think it was yeah I gotta say that it really does sell a lot, it does say a lot for JJ and crew and everybody involved with this movie. So the other thing that really does surprise me is that it's also said that the end of the teaser has a money shot that will take fans by surprise, that fans won't be able to predict and will leave many dying for answers. And additionally, this teaser is going to have a lot of quick glimpses in the footage that's actually going to be delivered for the fans. So with that being said, we're going to see a lot in this teaser. It's going to be very fast paced with a lot of glimpses here and there, showing us, you know, different experiences for the characters of Rey. Kylo and more. 
So anyways, guys, what do you think about the teaser? I know that you guys may have seen that story by Fanthatrax yesterday about the possibility of a teaser coming out either today or very soon, maybe even this weekend. Now, I'm not quite sure if that's actually going to come to fruition. We'll have to wait and see. If you guys would like to go ahead and check out that story, that is below in the description and in the comments. If you guys would like to go ahead and read that again, a uh, very interesting read for sure. Now, personally, if I were Disney and Lucasfilm, I would drop this teaser trailer right now. I feel like it's imperative at this point. They have to do it in order to really get the ball rolling and to really gain a lot of interest for fans. A lot of people are getting bored because they're not hearing about the title reveal. They're not hearing any kind of, you know, footage of Star Wars Episode Nine or seeing, I should say, any footage of this movie at all whatsoever just get a little taste of what's to come our way for this movie and yeah guys let me know what you think about all this below in the comments and if you guys did enjoy the content for today do make sure to drop a thumbs up on this video to support the channel i thank you also very much for the kind support and i'll catch you guys next time <laughs>